In order to run a successful business venture, it becomes necessary that you not only create an elegant website, but also your website should be easily navigable as well as it should be unique in order to stand out among your competitors. Now let's look at some of the tools provided. Now to create a page, we need to tap on more, tap on pages. To create a new page, we need to tap on add new page button. Enter a page name. Tap on save. We have successfully created a page. Now let's add some section to it. Let's add some banner image. Tap on add this block. Now tap on add image for banner. You can upload an image from gallery, camera. You can add an image from link. Or you can select an image from the image library. Now let's upload an image from gallery. You can see that the banner has been displayed. Now let's add a link to this banner. To do that, tap on the banner. Select link image option. Now let's link this banner to a product. Select product or service. Search for a product. Select the product. Finally, tap on save. Now, whenever a customer taps on the banner, they will be redirected to that product's page. Now let's add some more section. To do that, tap on this button. You can either add section above or section below. Now let's add some gallery images. Select gallery option. Tap on add this block. To add an image, tap on add image button. Here also you can upload images from the gallery, camera, link, my images or from the image library. Let's upload an image from gallery. Let's add some more images. Now if you want to edit the image, tap on the image. If you want to view the image, you can select the view image option. You can see the image preview. Now if you want to change the styling, you can tap on change styling. But before that, let's edit the image. To do that, tap on sort image gallery. You can sort the images by tapping move down or move up. Now if you want to edit the image preview, we need to tap on edit next to that image. Tap on edit next to the image thumbnail section. Let's modify this image and crop the image if you like. Tap on save. You can see that the image preview has been updated. Now tap on save. Again tap on save. You can see that the image preview has been updated. Now let's style this image. Again tap on the image. Tap on change styling. Let's alter its border width. Let's add some color to it. Ok, 
can see that the color has been altered. Notice how the width is changing as well. You can alter the image radius if you like. Upon dragging the slider, you can see that the border width is changing. You need to tap on save for every changes you make. You can apply some border designs if you like. And you need to tap on save. Now let's add some more sections. Now let's add a video block. Select the video option. Tap on add this block. Tap on add new video button. Let's add a YouTube link video. Paste the YouTube link. Add a suitable video title. Now let's add some video description as well. Finally, you can tap on save. You can see that the video link has been added. If you want to play it, tap on the play button. Now if you want to edit the video, tap on edit. Tap on edit video. Edit the video details and tap on save. If you have multiple videos, you can use the sort video option. Now if you want to display some more accessory types, such as jewelry along with this Lenga based web page, you can add another section. Let's add a layout section. Tap on add this block. You can see that the following layout section has been added. You can use this section to describe some more features of your website. In this case jewelry which can go well with the langas. Now let's add some more section such as services. Select amenities and services option. Tap on add this block. Now tap on add service. Enter a service name and select from the given list. You can create custom service if you like. Enter the service description in this region and tap on save. Let's add some more services. Tap on save. Let's add some more services. Tap on save. You 
now if you want to delete a service you can tap on the service and tap on delete now apart from adding sections you can even modify the header as well let's add some color to it tap on background you can either add a background image background color or select from the color palette let's add some background color you notice upon selecting the colors the background color is changing tap on save now if you want to edit the page tap on more tap on pages Select the button next to that page. Now if you want to rename the page, you can tap on rename. Rename the page and tap on save. If you want to duplicate the page, you can tap on duplicate. A separate page will be created with the same contents. can even give permissions for your pages with the help of permissions you can allow only certain type of customers to access your pages you can even add SEO details as well if you want to delete the page you can tap on delete and you can tap on yes delete to delete that very page now apart from customizing your own page and adding sections to it, you can even add a standard theme template if you like. To do that, you need to tap on more, tap on settings, tap on theme and select any feature theme. If you want to search for a theme, tap on the search icon. Search for a theme. Select a theme of your choice. To see a preview, tap on the theme. You can see this is currently the mobile view of that theme. If you want to see its web view that will be shown on the computer the slide the scroller you can see the computer theme as well if you want to apply that theme tap on apply theme tab it will ask you whether you want to change the theme tap on change theme You can see that the theme has been applied. Hence with the tools provided by Omni, you can create a unique website which could help you in promoting your business venture to potential customers. Thanks for watching. We hope that this video was helpful to you. If you have any questions, you can comment below or contact our customer support team. For more videos, subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for further updates.